Hi guys. I wanted to show you a product that I've had for a couple years. It is uh, called the Joy Tea Light Candle Lantern. It actually doesn't seem to have uh, a proper name other than Joy, J-O-I. Um, when I look it up, I always find it under Joy and I put in Tea Light Candles and Lantern and I find it eventually. It's made by a company called Caframo, C-A-F-R-A-M-O. These are the folks that make the EcoFan, which is the self-powered fans that sit on wood stove tops and power themselves and put the hot air throughout the room. It's a Canadian company. I think it is pretty cool. So let me show you what the lantern is all about. So what's a tea light? Most of you probably know. It's one of these little tiny candles about the size of a half dollar or a dollar. Burns, these particular candles should burn four to five hours to use in this light. Uh, the cheap one, do or one hour candles um, often will oversuit the inside and um, they just don't, you know, what's one hour worth of light worth? I guess it's worth something, but the three to four hour candles, some of them even go up to four and a half hours, uh, are just a little tiny bit more money, but gives you a lot more light. So that's the joy on the inside. Let me show you a little bit here on the outside. So this door closes up nice and tight and the top can stay down and make a little like pagoda type lantern and there are the LED lights but it can also pull up like a desk light so I'll pull this up and then adjust my camera so it can go all the way up like this which is about a good 12 inches the uh, top can be flipped many ways and then this can flip down and you can do it like that or come back up toward you and have it flip down like this very cool so I'll take it inside and we can um, test it out and you can see the kind of uh, light it puts out I their website really needs improvement they don't have much information on the um, LED lights that they don't tell us what the lumens are. I know it's enough to read by and it, um, the lights will stay on as long as the candle's burning so it's dependent on the candle quality. Um, let's see what else can I tell you. So when you open this up and you light the candle you leave the door open for 45 seconds and then close this up and really snap it into place. If you leave the door open for more than a minute there is a safety feature which will come into play and we can't see it but up in here there's a metal plate and if it gets too hot it will clamp down and will stop the candle from um, drafting out which will stop the power from happening so the candle will uh, burn out because there'll be no oxygen in there because the draft will be closed so when they say light the candle keep the door open for 45 seconds there's only about 15 seconds leeway and then you're having to let the unit cool down and then relight it and start all over again. Uh, it took me a while to figure out that I needed to be more exact, but I got there in time. So let's take it inside and I'll show you what it's all about. I'm just letting the seat up for 45 seconds, more or less. Let's see what happens.
So while this is heating up, I thought I'd talk a little bit about the, uh, there's a knockoff from the Joy uh, device here that we're looking at. It's called HCL, I don't know, Candle Lantern or something like that. It's sold on uh, Amazon and a couple other places, but I'd really encourage you to look at the reviews. So this device, this Joy um, Candle Lantern that we're looking at right now, runs about 90 bucks. You can get it in the 80s. I paid over 100 for mine, but the prices have dropped. And I did get mine off Amazon, but you can go directly to their site and find other real retailers as well. But this other one, HCL, blah, 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 is about $39.99. They also claim that you can charge your laptop or cell phone. Uh, they've got ports for that. However, when you look at the reviews, what you'll find... Oh, you can see the light starting to come on now, can't you? So it's only been like a minute or so. I might put this up. So what you'll find with the reviews is that not only are people unable to make that work, that part of the device work, uh, additionally they found out that the tea lights that we use and the standard size for a tea light is around 38 millimeters. The tea lights they take in that other device are uh, 36 millimeters. So you either have to change the way your device works, you know, make the the holder different, or you have to figure out how to get smaller tea lights or actually pare down your tea light, which means taking it out of the metal casing and cutting away some of the wax. Uh, so it just doesn't seem like a good idea to me, but you know, you're grown up, you'll read the reviews and make your own decisions on that. But you can see this puts out quite a bit of light, actually. It's really pretty cool. Um, let me go find something and we can see if we can read it. In, and again, while this is continuing to heat up, it'll get brighter and brighter and brighter. But hold on a second, let me grab some reading material. So I have uh, one of my seed books here. That This is just seeds that I planted this year and, and previous years. I've just taken a some photograph or uh, photograph holders and made this book so I can look at what I planted in previous years and see like this I saved seeds from this and I planted them this year so I can uh, reference back on that however you can see you can easily read this um, but you can even read it from your computer screen right now and this is all the light that I have going on in this area right now so overall, I think the Joy is a great little device that does put out a lot of light. I'll time it uh, as well and put in the comments how long this lasted, how many hours. Um, but this is a, about a four and a half hour tea light, so it'll probably last you know four or four and a half hours. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I'm gonna do some more light videos, but I'm gonna switch to hand crank solar battery operated and then I'll be doing kerosene and uh, oil lamps so stay tuned for more in the future and thanks for watching bye